conditions, but uh, yeah, let's, I'm just going to wing it. <laughs> um, well, if you met me like a couple weeks ago, um, I was a very like different person. Um, I was reckless, and um, I was just a heavy sinner. And uh, like there was a point in life when I was just like, I was laying down on my bed, and I was just wondering, where am I going with life? Like, this isn't fulfilling. Um, like, I thought I had so much fun. I would have fun at the moments. But then, like, at the end of the day, like, what did it mean to me? And I just felt like, you know, what was the purpose in my life? And uh, one day, uh, my good old friend from high school, uh, Andrew Lopez, who isn't here today, but he's, I'm sure he's here in spirit, he's, uh, he, he contacted me on Facebook, and I was just like, oh, nice, um, an old friend came to talk to me. And uh, he, he started telling me, oh, do you want to do Bible studies? And then at first I was kind of reluctant. I was like, I came from a Christian background, and I kind of was just like, I kind of cringed. I was like, uh, I don't want to do this. I, I'm not sure. But then I went with an open heart, and I tried it out. And uh, I thank God that I did, because everyone here, I'm so grateful for, because they changed my life. They, they just showed me truth, because one of the first things that uh, I learned just hanging out with these guys is that everything in the Bible is God-spoken, and I believe this even when I was a kid, I just, I just always made excuses, like everyone said earlier, like, you, you, you sin, and then you make excuses, like, mm. you can get away with it, yeah, like, oh, it's not my fault, something happened, oh, it's not this because this happened, no, it's, it's, it's real, it's like, you have to do it, because right. God calls you to do it. Yeah. yeah. So I'm just here because I want to know God. I want to seek God. Come on. I want to be saved. And I just, it's a short while, but I can say that I pretty much love everyone in this room. Aww. <laughs> um, yeah. uh, plus, um, I'm hoping in my life that uh, I can be that, that light because God says that we're a light. Yeah. And, um, in uh, Matthew 20, 20, 28, Come on, Richie. Matthew 29, verse 11. Oh, wait, no. Ah. <laughs> Actually, no. Uh, I take it back. I take it all back. Matthew 5, verse 16. Uh, it says that uh, <laughs> in the same way, let, let your light shine before men that they may see your good deeds and praise your Father in heaven. Amen. So I'm going to try... I'm not even gonna try it. I'm gonna be that light. I'm gonna I'm gonna live my life to be that light to shine before men so they can see God, so they can see his works, so they, Come on. they can see how awesome he really is. Yeah. And that's all I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> well, there is, um, I have two of the most important questions that you want to answer. Okay. The one, do you believe that Jesus Walked on earth and physically got put on the cross and died for your sins and rose on the earth. Sir, what is your good confession? Christ is not. Amen. What is your good confession? We cannot baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus. And you will receive the forgiveness of your sins. You'll be added to all these people that you already love. <laughs> Amen. <laughs>